Keanu Reeves has been one of Hollywood's most prolific actors for three decades, starring in a long list of hits from Bill and Ted and Point Break to The Matrix and John Wick. And just as long as that list are the movies he almost starred in. Lose! I don't lose! I win! The most infamous role Reeves didn't accept is, of course, Speed 2 Cruise Control. After the box office success of 1994's Speed, Fox courted Reeves for a sequel that would also feature co-star Sandra Bullock. But the actor had issues with the script, particularly the cruise ship setting, and turned down the $11 million paycheck to star in a local production of Hamlet in Winnipeg. Reeves has said Fox put him in, quote, movie jail, and it was more than a decade before he worked with the studio again. Tell me again, Harry, why did I take this job? Come on, 30 more years of this, you get a tiny pension and a cheap gold watch. Regardless, Reeves had turned down roles before and would continue to turn them down throughout his career. That list includes Charlie Sheen's in Platoon, Eric Stoltz's in The Fly 2, John C. Riley's in Chicago, Patrick Dempsey's in Enchanted, Billy Crudup's in Watchmen, Matthew Fox's in Speed Racer, and Eddie Murphy's in Bowfinger, which was actually written for Reeves. I don't want to do this anymore. What are you talking about? I don't want to do it. I just want to run Aaron. Heavenly God. Heavenly God. Keanu also turned down the role in 1995's Heat that went to Val Kilmer, the same actor he replaced in that year's Johnny Mnemonic. Reeves was also considered for Batman Forever, which went to Kilmer. Can I persuade you to take a sandwich with you, sir? I'll get drive through Reeves was later considered to play superhero Terry McGinnis for an R-rated Batman movie from the Remember the Titans director that never got made after Batman and Robin cooled off the franchise. And speaking of comic book movies, he was also considered for Wolverine, which went to Hugh Jackman and recently was set to play Jan Rogg in Captain Marvel, but had to back out to shoot the third John Wick, so Jude Law stepped in. Control it. Scheduling can be difficult when you are an in-demand actor like Reeves, and it's cost him other roles as well. He was originally attached to play Tug Speedman in Tropic Thunder, and Ben Stiller was going to play Agent Rick Peck, but the movie delayed, Reeves had other commitments, and Stiller stepped in for Tug and Matthew McConaughey for Rick. In a weird way, I had to sort of just free myself up to believe that it was okay to be stupid. Reeves was once attached to the object of my affection with Uma Thurman, but the movie was delayed and later got made with Paul Rudd and Jennifer Aniston. Keanu was also going to star in Shooter, but had to back out when it stalled, paving the way for Mark Wahlberg. At one point, Reeves had also expressed interest in playing Aragorn in Lord of the Rings movies, but that part went to Viggo Mortensen. Open war is upon you whether you would risk it or not. Reeves next returns to the screen in John Wick Chapter 3, Parabellum, and is shooting the long-awaited return of another franchise, 2020's Bill and Ted Face the Music. People keep asking if I'm back, and I haven't really had an answer. But now, yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. 